What's up, everyone? Happy Wednesday. Wednesday evening, we ride at dawn a long time after dawn. So we're out here doing our ride, my Wednesday ride, day 212 of the 365-day journey. And on the way up here, I uh, decided um, I would listen to some podcasts like I usually do. And my buddy Thomas Keenan showed up in the mix with his repeat of his podcast with um, Mark Zalinoff, the fitness ninja, and they were having a conversation that just really clicked with what I have going on. Um, when I left the house today, my family just said, um, why are you going on this ride? You just take a ride from another day and repost it. And I said, that would just be cheating myself. Why would I do that? And it kind of hurt me to think that my family's thinking like that, that I'm not doing the right job with them as far as uh, they think they can cheat themselves, and if they can cheat themselves, what else are they cheating? And with that, I jump on uh, the podcast, and uh, Mark and Thomas are talking about how they're instilling these values in their children and their families, and I'm realizing that I'm not doing a good enough job here, um, that uh, if my family's telling me that I should cheat myself out of my 365-day journey, 212 days in, um, I got to do a better job. So... Um, story of the day, you know, message of the day is, uh, are you pouring your values, your core values into the people around you? Are you pouring your core values into your family, to your children? Um, I got to do a better job because they're telling me that it's okay to cheat and it's not okay to cheat. Um, 212 days in a row, I have rode at least 10 miles a day. It's not always at dawn because this journey is tough. I've got to tell you, this is a big commitment I made. So we've been riding later in the day, um, had some COVID last week, recovered from that. I have been sleeping in a little bit in the morning because I just want to make sure I'm at tip top shape. I am actually making a little bit of excuses for that. And when I wake up in the morning, um, my kids are up and they want to play. The baby likes to pay, play Peppa Pig in the morning and she's four and I miss a lot of uh, baby time. So being home this week, um, it's kind of nice. So when she baby wants to play Peppa, we talked about this yesterday, we play Peppa. And then uh, get caught up in some stuff around the house and had to do some real estate stuff. And now finally got to do the ride. Everything quieted down at home. I said, let me go out and do the ride. And we're doing a little extra ride today. I'm eight miles in. Uh, we'll probably do about 16. And um, my family said, why don't you cheat and stay home? Uh, that's not sitting right with me. And... Uh, I happened to sit, happened to listen to the podcast, and uh, I got to go home and I got to talk to them. I got to do a better, better job with that. But um, it's a great podcast. Talk, go on to um, Step It Up podcast. Thomas Keenan's this week's podcast with Mark Zalinoff, two of my favorite people, uh, two kick-ass people that can just get stuff done in life. And uh, listen to that. Listen to what they're saying about uh, their families and what they're pouring out into their families and to their children. Um, good stuff. Good stuff. And then tomorrow. Uh, we're going to do a little special message. Thomas doesn't know it yet. So Thomas is up here in New York, and he asked me to help him out with something. And, of course, uh, no problem. I'm happy to help my brother out. And so I'm going to go meet him in the morning. We've got to take care of something um, for him. And we're going to do a live tomorrow with Thomas. So I'm going to do my ride in the morning tomorrow. And then we're going to get a message from Thomas. Thomas is a powerhouse in the, uh, the mindset world, coaching world, business world. And uh, he's actually the reason I got into uh, this ride. And uh, Mark is also the reason I got into this ride between fitness and uh, mindset and getting stuff done. Um, joining Apex is all because of Thomas um, when I sold his house uh, a little over a year ago because he went down to uh, BCOO of Apex. Um, I wound up making a connection with Jessica and him. And next thing you know, I got pulled in. And now we're, uh, I don't know, seven, eight months into this Apex journey and uh, life's changing. All good stuff. Trying to inspire everyone. Uh, reaching out to a lot of people. A lot of people thanking me, which is really, really cool. And um, it's all good stuff around. So uh, message of the day. What are you pouring into your family? Are, are you giving them the values that you have? Um, are you spreading your core values to them? Um, is it okay for them to cheat? Because it's never okay in life to cheat. And if my kids think it's okay for me to cheat this ride, um, I got to do a better job. So, all right, there's your message. Um, we got to jump on prayers. We're over here by the Woodmere Country Club, uh, by some rich guy's house. Just wanted to find some light. 
some wild houses back in here. Let's do some prayers because uh, we skipped them this morning, so we got to do prayers every day. Do it, Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, help us to uh, stay faithful and uh, true, and help us to not cheat in life, help us to not take shortcuts, and help us to instill those values into our family and our friends and those around us. Um, it's never okay to cheat. We always have to do the work and get things done the right way. And uh, amen. So, all right, everyone. Uh, hope you had a great Wednesday. I'm going to go ride home eight miles home. We'll do about 16 today, a little extra because we're doing it at night. And um, all good stuff. So tomorrow I'm going to ride in the morning. Then we're going to get a special message with my buddy Thomas Keenan, spread some value to you. And it's almost New Year's Eve. Um, not much time left to get your stuff done this year. A couple goals left to meet. You got to hit them and uh, start making that plan for next year. So, all right, everyone, I appreciate you. God bless. Put your head in a pillow every night knowing you made the world a better place. Fire starts fire. Go inspire someone in your life to be a better person while you make yourself better in the process. All right, everyone, have a great night.